Welcome back again to my channel Velix Vlog. For this video, Velix Vlog presents my homemade avocado ice candy good for business this hot summer. And I would like to thank to all my friends also who have been my members, Velix Vlog family members. Thank you, Vel family members. Thank you to Chadine, Keller Wills, and Rodaline. Thank you also to Hence Blog for Life, Mr. RJ Quiz and AG Bezel. And thank you also to your TV in the Emily Bills Moto and Dara Lu. Hello mga friendship for today's vlog. I am making a homemade avocado cocoa ice candy. Panlasang Pinoy. So we have our ingredients. I have two avocados here. It's already filled. I already filled up. Then we have one half cup of fresh milk. Later on, when I'm gonna put this in the blender, I'm gonna blend this one. I put this one half cup of coconut milk and avocado. And I also have here, I'm using coconut, sports, string, and syrup. So, three tablespoons of coconut sports springs. And I have one cup of um, cornstarch. And I'm gonna use this one also, sweetened condensed milk, only half can of it. So let's see. So I'm just gonna try half can of condensed milk. So it will, so our ice cream is not gonna be too sweet. So let's start now, guys. First and foremost, I'm I'm gonna blend this um, avocado so it's gonna be smooth. So I'm gonna add in the one half cup of fresh milk and then let's put it let's blend it let's do it guys let's blend this avocado I'm just gonna use the pulse one so it's not so just like that so the texture of avocado is not it's it's still there it's not gonna be so smooth. So I like it like that. When you eat the ice candy, you can taste some avocado. Guess okay, so let's open. Let's see how the, how the avocado. There you go. Yummy fresh avocado. Mm, it's gonna be yummy. So I like it like this texture. This texture is perfectly enough, so let's put this aside. And the meanwhile, in the pot, uh, I put two cups of water. So here, to dilute the cornstarch. So, since this is my first time to make ice candy, um, so I'm just gonna ask, estimate the estimate the water. So I'm gonna add in the one cup of corn starts here. Oopsie, oopsie daisy. And let's it mix. And then later I'm gonna bring it to boil. Okay, this water is just estimated two cups. I put two cups first. And then let's bring it to boil, guys. Until the corn starts gonna fully cook. I bring it to boil like on the fire already into um, medium heat and then we constantly mix this it's already mixed up so we constantly mix this up until it's fully cooked and then when this is already cooked we add in the condensed milk let it boil Guys, this is what happened after boiling the one cup of cornstarch and two cups of water. It's so thick, so two cups is not enough for one cup of water. I mean, two cup, two cups is not enough for one cup of cornstarch. But anyhow, later on, I'm gonna add more boiling water later on. But just for now, I'm gonna add condensed milk. I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add this one can of condensed milk so 
then I'll add here just one can so not all of them not the whole can because I don't like it to be sweet, too sweet so one half can only that's it there we go and then let's mix it mix 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 let's pour in the one cup of boiling water Continue to mix it constantly while you let it boil. So we have three cups of water for one cup of cornstarch. We have one half cup of condensed milk already inside. I think it's okay now. It's boiling already and cornstarch is cooked. So you just need to constantly stir it so the cornstarch will not make any lines. So let's off the fire and continue to stir it because the heat is still there. Later, I'm gonna add the uh, coconut spray strings. Guys, let's add in the see, coconut string. Stir it, mix it, it up. I don't want this um I'm not gonna put this in fire anymore because the coconut is actually we need to cook. So just like that, just add in. Because when you put it on fire, the coconut is going to be hard. Okay, and continue to stir it. And then later on, we are going to add the avocado. But I want this one to be cold down. When it's already cold down, I'm gonna add the avocado so the freshness of avocado is still there. It's already cold down. Just not really cold, just a little bit warm. So I'm gonna add in the avocado. all of them guys guys uh, let's repack our ice candy now so I'm using this um, ice candy bag size 2 by 10 it's actually from the Philippines let's start now so I'm using this in bodo to make it easy it's like panel it's easy to refill the plastic bag Let's start repacking now. I fill this in bodo. And later on after this, we put it in the freezer. So we are not gonna put this like we only put around uh, three four four. Uh, one four four. I think that one. This one. So we have enough space to tie it up so it's like this it's like around three inches or something and then just tweeze it and tie it up 
course, before we put it in the freezer, we have to wash it first. So this one, there's some there with it. It's not gonna be sticky. So this is the ice candy now, guys. Since this one is a little bit warm, so I have to put it in cold water. I make sure I'm gonna, and then wash here. I'm washing it here on the top because there's some. I don't want it to be sticky there. So, later on, I'm gonna put it in the freezer. It's still warm. So I'm, I'm gonna put it in the freezer when it's already cold. So it's still a bit warm. This is gonna be this is gonna be the second one. So let's just keep continuing doing like this until we finish all of the and the pot so just keep going on and forth until we finish okay mga friendship we, i'm already finished um, i already repacked my ice candy so and i already wash and drain it so this time i'm going to put it in the ziplock because we have fish in the freezer i don't want it to be smell like fish I don't want to be smelly. So I'm going to put it in the Ziploc and then put it in the freezer. And then the next morning, we have, we have ice candy. By the way guys, if you notice why I didn't um, blender the avocado so much. Because, you know, I don't want it to be smoky. I want texture. I want avocado and the ice candy. As you can see, there is avocado here. So, I want it like that. So, I only use a pulse in two seconds, twice. So, I want it to have like this. Here is it. I already put all my ice candy. So, and the zip look. So, let's sell it. And just correction um, I actually use six cups of water for one cup of um, cornstarch so I started to put two cups and it's too thick so I add three and then I and I add another one until it reads into six so I have your 13 ice candy 